Hi guys, Valentina here and welcome to my new video. Today I'm extremely happy because I'm going to show you my bungee jumping experience. It won't be only one video, but two. In the first video I was filmed from the bridge and in the second video I was filmed with a GoPro attached on my chest while I was doing the jump, so make sure to watch to the end. I already know how much I love traveling and adventures, so of course I decided to show you this experience so you can feel the adrenaline moment too. And of course, to show you on which way I was facing my fear of heights, as well you can read more about it in my last blog article, and if you scroll down in info, you can click on the link. The place where I was doing bungee jumping is called Maslenica Bridge, and Maslenica Bridge is located in the middle of Croatia. It's the highest bungee jumping in Croatia, being 56 meters high. Slenica Bridge has a spectacular views over Adriatic Sea and Novskoj Drilo Strait. Drilo. I think it's also worth mentioning about Maslenica settlement that it's close by to Maslenica Bridge. There we ate super delicious food for reasonable prices, which is not the case with the cities like Zadar, Split, Dubrovnik and so on. I was doing bungee jumping with a company called Isos of Tours. Isos of Tours is an agency that is doing extreme sports. The guys are super professional and super funny, which is, of course, I think the main thing that is making this bungee jumping experience much less scarier, or not. History of bungee jumping. So according to legend, bungee jumping first appeared in the South Pacific. There was this guy called Tamali and unfortunately Tamali was abusing his wife. His wife of course didn't like that and she decided one day to run away from him. Tamali started after her and she climbed on a tree, she tied something around her ankles and the moment when Tamali wanted to grab her she immediately jumped. Tamali jumped after her and of course he died because he didn't have nothing tied around his ankles. From that moment on, the village elders decided to build a tower and the tower was a part of the ritual. The ritual was kind of initiation of young boys who needed to do bath first. After they should climb on a tower, they should bring their wives. They started to say all the complaints in front of the whole village to their wives and after they would jump to prove their manhood. So back then bungee jumping was a ritual and today bungee jumping is extreme sport and even today it became a tourist attraction and of course today we have much better ropes. They are designed to stretch not to break and they are all the time tested that you have minimum chance to have some kind of injury or accident and I know we were all watching those videos where people are having bad accidents while they're doing bungee jumping but the fact is the chance is minimal uh, the problem is people are not exploring enough and by exploring I mean people are not researching if they are suitable to do bungee jumping there are certain people that they shouldn't do bungee jumping and those are the people who are having back problems, heart problems, different kind of addictions. More you can see in information below if you click on the link to uh, see my last blog article. The second thing is people are not listening carefully to instructions of their bungee instructor. So that's also very important, always do what has been said to you. And the third reason is people are choosing bad companies, companies that are not legit, companies that are not testing enough their ropes. There are two main rules that you should always remember while you're doing bungee jumping. You should always jump as far as you can. It's the pretty same like with cliff jumping. And of course, you have to always keep your hand hand spread so you shouldn't at any point touch anything if you jump straight down you are risking that the rope pulls you back into itself and in that moment it can scratch you it can make you an injury and it's really not a pleasant experience 
I mean, you can see that in my second video, which was filmed with a GoPro attached on my chest. something as magical and unforgettable as bungee jumping and whether is that in Croatia or elsewhere in the world I promise you won't regret it okay I'm signing off now thank you for watching guys I hope you enjoyed the video and make sure to subscribe to support me and to see more of my adventures in the future ciao ciao